All right, so what I'm gonna do here now is I'm gonna do my Gorilla Tape that I got there, just sitting right there on top of my bench. Nice thick roll of Gorilla Tape. And I'm going to reinforce these seams that I have because as you can see, this one came apart when that Super 77 glue got uh, too warm and let go, even though it is a uh, permanent adhesive. It, not so permanent. So, um, I'm going to grab that. And for anybody that hasn't worked with Gorilla Tape, this is my first roll of Gorilla Tape. And uh, it's a nice thick roll. It is a double thick adhesive. I did pull a little piece off um, there yesterday just to see kind of what it was like. But, try and get that to kind of stick to itself there. And uh, so anyways, I'm going to go over this strip too wide. So one strip here, one strip here, probably. And uh, just to reinforce it all, um, yeah, I did pull a piece of this stuff off yesterday, and it is extremely tough to work with. It is probably 10 times the adhesive of duct tape. So I'm going to try and get the camera set up here in a way that... Uh, You guys can see kind of what I'm doing down there. I think you can see that seam. Oh yeah. You can see that seam from there. Maybe bring it back a little bit. Pull the screw out of the shot. There. That should be good. Now this, like I say, this stuff is extremely tough to work with. Um, gonna want my knife handy. Cut this off with and prepare for battle pretty much. Just getting this off the roll of itself is difficult so when you're putting it on you want to make sure you're putting it where you want it to go. Because I don't think there's any pulling this off to reposition. Yay, adhesive string stuck to my fingers. There we go. So my 
first strip run, now I'll start from this side and work my way back over. Just because I want to hide all of this uh, duct tape that I had here. If you notice, I'm literally bending over backwards to do stuff for, for this project. Not even just figuratively at this point. But you do what you gotta do. A knife within reach. closer look at what that looks like. It's definitely a lot nicer looking than the duct tape because you got the duct tape which is thin and all ripply and stuff. Then you have the Gorilla Tape which is considerably thicker. You can see there. I definitely like the Gorilla Tape over the duct tape. Um, I don't know. Definitely think it performs at this point better. Anyways, you can even see, or at least I can, I can see how much thicker that that tape is there than this piece here. So, you know, they, they do say it's a double thick adhesive and yeah, it's, it's pretty thick tape. It's hopefully holds really well too. But I guess this will be a good test for it. But I got another bit of a gap there where the tape let go a bit. So I'm going to go over that one, go over this one, get all of these gaps fixed up. Um, I may even need to get another roll of this stuff. But we'll see how that goes. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to continue on that and we'll catch up on that later.